Hey everyone. Good morning. It is Thursday the 3rd. I'm sitting at my island. Just got done eating breakfast. Looking at my mess over here. <laughs> my house is not always spotless. Those dishes. Oh, there's Grant barking. Got a mess on the counter from yesterday. The kitchen is always the worst part of the house. I bought a, um, a new crock pot that has three, um, 1.3 liters, I think it is. Um, I kept saying this Thanksgiving that I wish I would have had one of those to sit here on my island and plug in to keep like the gravy, the corn, carrots, whatever, warm as I was getting other things done that I could just sit it over here and forget about those things. Um, so my daughter works at JC Penney's. Look at, and there's my laundry, my big basket of laundry. <laughs> um, so my daughter works at JC Penney and got me a really good deal with her discount uh, for that. So it's the uh, JC Penney. I think it's their brand cooks cooks the crock pot so yeah um so yeah just let the boy I got bacon over there i gotta put away <laughs> yeah so my house isn't always spotless it's nice out i don't know why grant wants in right now just went out it's probably because i'm not outside with him so yeah i've got tons of laundry to do but the best part if you keep an orderly house at least. My floors need to be swept and clean. But if you kind of try to keep it clutter free um, and you pick up every night before you go to bed, except for my kitchen, <laughs> the rest of the house at least is pretty good. So I've only got this one, my laundry and, this, and the kitchen always, always the kitchen you got to clean up. Um, let's go see how the other room looks. I'm not sure. And of course my grooming stuff's out because I still have five other dogs to groom. I've got a rug hanging here because I didn't want hair all over it. And I got my grooming jacket hanging here on this gate. And we keep this gate here um, if you're a new subscriber so the dogs can't get upstairs and eat the cat litter. So what's going on out here? There's a toy, dog toy. I haven't opened the curtains yet. Just the one where uh, Merlin lays all the time. So in here's pretty good too. Um, I just didn't put my laptop away and the signs are knocked over from my, me sitting my laptop there. But everything else is pretty good out here. Um, so if you do quick tidies throughout the day of all the other rooms, this stuff like my laundry laying here <laughs> and my messy kitchen, that'll take me no time to clean up. A lot of people were asking me to do a cleaning video, a cleaning routine routine. I really don't have a cleaning routine. Um, let's let Grant in. I don't have a cleaning routine. I just, I'm a stay at home homemaker. Um, I really, I used to call myself a stay at home mom, but my kids are adults now. So I'm a stay at home homemaker. And I, that's my job is to keep my house orderly and, a, and clean. So, um, I, clean um and do all the household stuff pretty much all day it never ends <laughs> it never ends and i take care of the dogs that's my job so um i just do stuff every day to keep the house in order um especially the big thing is trying to keep things uh picked up through throughout the day and make sure everything in your house has a spot um like when I'm done grooming, I have a spot for that. Clean it, put it away. Um, that's the biggest thing. So, yeah, so I've got, let's open up these curtains. Let's open up these curtains, boys, so you can look at the squirrelies. Um, what do I got to do today? I've got to go to the grocery store. I've got to get some tomato tomato juice because I'm going to make some goulash tonight for dinner. I thought I had some and I don't, so I need to stock that up in my pantry. Um, 
might go to Target with my daughter. She's off today. Um, she said she needs to run to Target. I really need to groom Magnum right here. I want to get him done today. Um, so if I get him done today, then I've only got four left to do. Grant really needs to be groomed too. Um, his leg hair is getting pretty long. And his paw hair. Because if you remember, uh, when did I groom him last? It was before... It was a little bit before his surgery, I think, when I groomed him. But his hair and his uh, paws and stuff is getting long. I had another comment wondering why I keep them short. And uh, the main reason is because I take care of seven dogs. And um, as everyone knows who owns Schnauzers, that leg and belly hair, long leg and belly hair collects everything leaves dirt grass <laughs> snow in the winter um and i um just decided i remember i think it's when i when i just had four no it was when i just had three when i got marley um when they all came in with just clumps of um snow on them and it would take forever to get it melted off. And then they were wet. I'd have to dry them. Every time they went outside, I said, this is horrible for them. They're constantly cold because they're constantly got this snow matted up on them. And then they're wet forever. Um, so I decided then when I had Mozzie, just Mozzie, Max, and Marley. That was before I was really, I was making videos. I didn't really start putting any kind of videos up till I got uh, Miggy. Um, I just thought they're, they're going to be short haired schnauzers. <laughs> and, um, I mean, and if you have schnauzers, you know how hard it is just to keep, um, their beards from being dirty and knotted, um, and clean. So, um, when you have seven dogs like I do and have a house to clean and other things to do too, it's just easier for me to, uh, keep them short, keep them clean, keep them um, comfortable, um, too. So, um, so that's why I keep them short. So I, that's, a, uh, that's one of the top questions I get <laughs> about the boys is why I keep them short. Look how you're sitting in that chair. Look how you're sitting in that chair. <laughs> Are you listening to me? Are you listening to me talk about you guys? Huh? Are you? <laughs> Is he always sitting on his bum? Oh my goodness, you're so cute, Mozzie. He's doing really good after he got his anal glands expressed yesterday. He's been acting a little bit more peppier. So I guess I may have to start taking him in to get those done more um, regularly. So maybe as dogs get older, they have more problems. I don't know. Um, I've never, um, our first dog, Ginger, who was a shepherd mix that we got from the Humane Society, um, I never had a problem with her with them. I never really even knew anything about anal glands back then. <laughs> Dogs. So maybe, um, you're just so cute, Maz. You're listening to me. <laughs> they do listen to me. It's funny. I know you guys notice it, um, in the videos. I don't, I notice it when I watch the videos back, how they listen to me talk. Yeah. So, um, yeah, I really didn't know about anal glands. I better go check the other boys. So, and I wanted to um, apologize last night. I uploaded um, my video and then noticed I needed to make a change to something. And I had to then set it to private and um, fix it and then republish it. So I apologize if anybody was watching that video and it uh, was taken down and you were probably thinking, what happened? <laughs> Where'd the video go? I apologize. So, if you haven't seen that video, make sure you watch it. Um, yesterday's video, uh, there's a giveaway in there. And you can find out how you can win, uh, win that if you watch that video. I didn't want to put it in the title because I want it to be people who actually watch my video, not people who um, just um, search for giveaways and try to win them and they're not subscribed to the channel so make sure you watch that video because you have till the 14th to enter and i'm announcing the winner on december 15th so all right guys got lots to do today um 
So I will let you guys go. Let me get this kitchen cleaned <laughs> and um, get the house picked up. And we will see you again in our next video. Bye, guys.